So to kick it off, we've got a hot dog toaster. This was $19 on Amazon, had over 6,000 reviews with a 4.2 average. How much do you have to love hot dogs to actually buy one of these for yourself? I think, I think, that, I, I think honestly they make these exclusively so that people will kind of like gift them as half a joke. <laughs> yeah. But we're honestly uh, hoping that this is not junk because we're both very hungry, hungry. <laughs> <laughs> and who doesn't like hot dogs? So we actually went shopping earlier today. <laughs> but so this is, I think this is basically a toaster with a different insert. Like, it can't be any more complicated than that. This is, wait, what is that for? Oh, those are tongs. <laughs> so it comes with <laughs> the cheapest tongs ever. <laughs> Show the toaster up close. Yeah. So it's got a retro design. It actually says retro series. Okay, so you can cook two hot dogs at a time. This is where the buns go, and this is where the two, what, wieners? Is that what they're called? Sausages? Go. Hot dogs? <laughs> hot dogs go. You know, I have this theory of you can actually tell the quality of the products by the types of stickers that they use. Hmm. There's stickers that peel off really easily without leaving residue. Those are those are good quality products because they didn't skip out on that. <laughs> How did this one do? And this one did pretty well. There's there's zero residue. Let's go ahead and start it on the third setting right in the middle. And... Oh, did that not go down by itself? The hot dogs did, but the buns needed a little oh, push because really it was there. tight. Oh. Uh, this is not looking good. <laughs> Hold on. I think I just burnt the edges of the bread. <laughs> oh, this is... This is not looking super amazing. So That's it just... It just kind of burnt the sides right, of the bread. You take this, that one and I'll take this one. Well, we're we're not we're not done yet. I'm not satisfied right, with this. Put it back in. Use the stop button. Oh no! <laughs> oh, that's not. That's terrible. pretty good. That's not. Yeah, I like it a little that. charred. <laughs> it's, it's not the most appetizing meal I've seen. Dude, that's a lot of ketchup, man. The bread is crispy. Hot dogs warm all the way through. Yeah, honestly, like my expectations were so low for this thing that I'm like, I don't know why I'm surprised that it heats things up. So I'd say it works better than I expected, but I wouldn't actually want it personally at a gift exchange. So junk or gem? I'm going to say junk. I'm going to say gem in the context of white elephant gifts. Because like, I can actually see myself using this from time to time, and that's more than I can say about pretty much all of the other white elephant gifts that I've ever gotten. That's fair. Yeah, so it's not completely useless. It, it does what it's, it does, it surprisingly does what it says it does to a decent quality. So I think this is a gem. Are you sure you don't want to change your rating? We just ate six hot dogs. <laughs> I, and I thought, I think we kind of enjoyed them. <laughs> if, they make good hot dogs. It, I don't know about good hot dogs, they make edible hot dogs, and we did kind of enjoy them. That's, a, that's like, that's like meeting the bar for gem, I think, for in this context of like white elephant gifts. I'll agree with that. All right, we'll, we'll change that one to a gem. All right, fair enough. So the next category we wanted to get into... <laughs> I'm sorry, we can't just like down six hot dogs and call it junk.